it's Monday, April the 11th. It's quarter after 11 in the morning, and now I'm going to call the director of finance for the District of Saanich. Now, this Valatini is well aware of the invoices that it's been issued, and I'm being stonewalled, right? So let's take a little phone call here to Valatini and see what the excuse is of why it hasn't paid the invoice, because now today, you see, rent is due, and I don't have any money to do anything. Right now, why would that be when this has been going on for months? So let's go inform Valatini that it's personally responsible in its personal capacity for causing me loss, harm, and injury. Let's see if it's halfway intelligent. Valentini, Director of Finance for the District of Saanich. I'm in the office, but unable to take your call right now. Please leave a message, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks, and have a great day. You may start your message now. Press zero to return to the attendant. This is Victoria Nevins calling you, Valentini. I know you know who I am. My number is 250-661-0610. Now, those in the District of Saanich are well aware that my spouse and I have had our home stolen by CIBC and the Provincial Court of British Columbia. I've explained this multiple times. I have a copy of the contact I sent you. I've issued you an invoice. Um, this district has a financial duty to pay for my living expenses, and those living expenses are retroactive from when I got violently force evicted from my stolen interest private property, which you actually can't do for many legal reasons and that they embezzled all the money, leaving me homeless and destitute. So the District of Saanich has been issued an invoice for close to $37,000. You have to pay it. You have to pay because if you don't pay it, you're committing a myriad of indictable crimes and civil torts, of which you are going to be held responsible in your personal capacity. So I'm, I'm calling you to issue you a notice of liability, that if you don't pay that invoice and call me back and let me know that the invoice has been paid, and that there's been a check issued for the invoice because it's your duty, it's a fiduciary duty. I've explained all of this to you. I've explained my rights to you. I've explained the situation to you. You're not going to continue to stonewall me. You're not going to continue to steal money from me that it belongs to me. Right? Do you understand what I'm saying? Do you understand anything I'm saying? You must understand, because what's going to happen is your refusal to pay this invoice is going to cost the District of Saanich big time, because then I'll have to sue the District of Saanich because the District of Saanich is responsible in its legal capacity. So then I'm going to have to talk to your buddy there, Michael Hargraves, who also is well aware of what's going on here, right? So if it's all about the money, and you folks are all about the money because I'm well aware that you're a private for-profit corporation, despite the fact you've got all this crap on your website about, you know, being all about the people who live here in the district, that's not my experience with you at all. So the invoice has been issued to you, you haven't paid it, now it's overdue, and I want to know what's going on. So everything's going to be recorded because this is more than likely going to end up in B.C. Provincial Court, and you're going to end up in there in your personal capacity for all the loss, harm, and damage you've caused me, because for some reason you don't seem to understand. So you're going to explain to me why you don't understand. Because you can be guaranteed I do. Okay, Valatini, you can call me back at 250-661-0610 with confirmation that you've issued the check for the invoice you've been issued. Weeks ago you were issued the invoice. Why am I still waiting for you to pay the invoice? These are the questions you've been asked. You're going to have to answer these questions, Vala. So I look forward to hearing from you with confirmation. You've got that check ready and for confirmation of why it took you so long to um, pay the invoice.